Hey, what's going on guys? It's Zeno here, and we are back with some more Undertale. Last episode, we annihilated Undyne. Thank God that is finally over. That took forever. Anyways, we are back here, or not back, but we are now here at Dr. Alphasis Lab. So, let's go in. Alright, so what's different? Still watching us like a creeper, okay. Um, what's that? Speed up figurine of a female human with cat ears. Huh. Still haven't changed. And if we also go in the fridge, we can get instant noodles. So, yes, let's take that. Because that will be very helpful for later. So, there's Metaton. Haven't seen them in a hot minute. Alright. Oh, there you are. You ugly little creature. You've made quite a name for yourself. Such infamy. I'm impressed. Oh, yes. If you're looking for Alphys, she's not here. While you were busy doing your <clears throat> thing, uh, she was running around evacuating people to safety. Now they're in a place where you'll never get to them. Deciding not to fight you, my my, she really is the only smart one, isn't she? Oh, how sassy. <laughs> You're just itching to get your hands on me, aren't you? Well, too bad. This world needs stars more than it needs corpses. Toodles! <laughs> oh man. Have, haven't changed a bit, have you, Metaton? Alright. Is is that true lab thing still open? Man, it's not. Okay. Alright, so... Let's go over here, see if we find anything different. Ooh, what's this? An incredible invention. When not in use, this bed folds into an extremely easy-to-draw box. <laughs> wow. Nice, dude. <laughs> Alright. So let's just follow Metaton, I guess. We don't really have any other choice now, do we? Alright. Oh, it's so quiet, man. Well, there's something. Wait, can I get an encounter here? Because if I can, then I'm just going to go ahead and do my grinding, and it doesn't look like I can, so... Oh, well. Alright. Oh, we can get encounters here. Okay, so we are going to go ahead and do our grinding right now, and I'll get back with you guys whenever I'm done. Okay, never mind. It seems like that was a scripted encounter, so I'm just gonna keep on going, because I don't want to waste too much time on that. Ooh, a save point. 39 left. Alright. Oh, so there's Sundare Plane. Alright. Not on purpose or anything. Okay, let's... One shot this thing if we. Okay, never mind. I uh, forgot how its attacks are. There we go. Sundar Plane is dead now. But, but I never got to. Oh. oh. Wow. <laughs> okay. So, can we get encounters right now or no? Like, maybe they're scripted. I don't, I don't know though. Like, as I said, this is my first time playing Genocide, so I, I wouldn't know. Alright, let's go up here. Oh, the bridge. Okay. I think this is the place to grind. I'm not sh I'm not sure, to be honest. Like, I saw a guide earlier, and... Um, I don't... It just said to do everything before the Metaton fight. But, to be honest, I don't... I don't really know. To be honest, um... Alright. Oh, this changed. Wait, no, it didn't. What am I talking about? Okay. So, oh yeah, that's the little puzzle, and I'm guessing it's already solved, correct? I hope it is. Yep, it is. Okay, so here's the two knights. You're here, so that means Undyne. She's, like Undyne, will avenge you. Alright. Alright, there we go. So, wow, that's a lot of damage. You! Okay. And we got hit, like, once... And take you out too. Okay, nice. We leveled up too. Wow, that was a lot of XP. Okay, so we're just gonna keep on going. And this is Metaton's cooking show, correct? Uh, I think it is. Yeah, it is. All right. We might get to uh, the final boss today. I don't know, guys. I mean, maybe. I, I'm not sure. You know. All right. So I read in the guide that. I need to get one more scripted encounter, and then I can start the grinding. Uh, yeah, so let's go up the elevator. Uh, left floor three. 
Alright. So, can I get an encounter here? That'd be really nice if I could. Oh, it's this. Some sort of powerful bracelet. Wait, it's just a croissant. <laughs> it's a spider donut. It looks more rubbery than usual. Huh. Alright. Oh, great. This puzzle. Woo, I love this puzzle so much. Alright. And up. Oh wait, no, 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 that's the puzzle. No, we go down here. Yeah, that's right. Oh, great, right. I just... Yeah, okay. This way, that way, down, down. Right, 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 up, right. There we go. Alright, now this is the right way, okay. So, here is, uh, Mafei. We gotta fight her. Sorry about that slight cut there, I did something stupid, so, yeah. Did you hear what she said? Uh, no, I did not. They said a human wearing a striped shirt will come through. Okay. I heard that they hate spiders. Yeah, you're, you're right. Trust me, I do. I heard that they love to stomp on them. I heard that they like to tear their legs off. Jesus. Not just spiders, man. Come on. <laughs> Don't generalize me. I heard. that they have some awful taste. What a shame. A human comes through and they aren't even fit to be eaten. Oh well, rotten ingredients can always be discarded. Oh, wow. Okay, so, can we... Uh, do we just attack her, or what? Because I think... Okay, never mind. I thought there was, um, a betrayal kill, but I guess not. Um, what is that? Spider... Uh, what? What is that? Looks like a flower. Oh. Well, that's depressing. Wow. Wow. Okay. Um, that's kind of depressing. All right. So this is Metaton's show, I think. I I think this is where Metaton like serenaded us. I'm not sure though. Yeah, it is. Okay, so I just keep going this way, and then, yeah, okay. Then up here is the, is the, yeah, that's the thing. Okay. So now there's 35 left, so this is the point where I need to be, and this guy's still here selling stuff. Why do I always get the freaks? <laughs> um, oh, okay. Nothing else to do? Okay, what about evacuation? Evacuation? You're yanking my chain, little weirdo. So what is so what if everybody else left work? So what if nobody's buying anything? Par for the course, little weirdo. Par for the course. <laughs> well, Benetton didn't tell me I had to work, so I guess. But that's the thing. Sometimes he doesn't even call me into work and let, until halfway into my shift. If I don't play it safe, he's going to yell at me. Okay, maybe yell is the wrong term. It's more like he has this CD album he plays that's entirely full of songs about how bad I am at my job. <laughs> um, huh? Everyone else is dead? Does that mean that I don't have to work today? God, that if we're, that it were true, little weirdo. That it were true. <laughs> uh, let's threaten. Sorry, little weirdo. Threats won't work on me. I can't go to hell. I'm all out of vacation days. <laughs> wow. Okay, so let's buy... Steak in the shape of Metadon's face, what? Heal 60 HP, okay. Hero sandwich, attack up in battle. Um, we're gonna need some of those, so yeah, I'll buy those later. Alright, so, alright, let's see what we got in our inventory. We can get rid of the crab apple, because we do not need that. And get rid of this too. And there's also, we can steal some money. Um, I don't know where though. I don't know where I go to steal the money. Um, not sure. There's a place where I can buy the weapons uh, too, or where I can buy a weapon too. Um, not sure where that is though. Um, over here maybe. Okay. What about over here? Nowhere. Okay. Well, never mind. I'm stupid. <laughs> All right. So let's just uh, keep going forward and see what happens there because I was supposed to buy a weapon somewhere up in here I'm not sure where it is though all right but first I guess let's buy 
Uh, let me see what the guy tells me to buy, because I'm not about to lose my genocide run here, you know? I mean, I'm way too far in to lose now. Okay, so scripted Vulcan, uh, Sunder Plane, uh, Rural Guards got that, Muffet got that. Buy the empty gun and cowboy hat inside the Metaton Hotel. They equip them, then put all items besides anything for the final boss uh, in the box. So CT or noodles in the box, okay. Um, cowboy hat, okay, so it is in the Metaton Hotel. I just gotta find it. I don't know where to find it though, so that's the only issue. Alright. Maybe over here? I don't know, man. Um, over here? Okay. No answer, and... No answer, huh. Alright, so... Maybe up here? Oh, no, 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 I know where it's at, I know where it's at. I know where it's at. It's over here. That's right, that's right, okay. Yeah, because there was a secret boss, but like nobody came and stuff. <laughs> Alright, let's take a uh, empty gun and cowboy hat and mystery key. Okay, let's steal 5G. Wow, okay. Uh, read. Hey, if you're reading this, then like bad news, you mega evil weirdo. Alpha just came here and she's talking and she's taking us someplace super duper safe. But first, we gotta use up these gel pins. Yeah, chill, Alpha. So we don't want to waste pins. And don't even think about stealing our stuff. Yeah, creep. Leave our chunk alone. Caddy, it's not junk. It's really valuable. Yeah, our garbage is really valuable. Anyway, in closing, you're a total loser. <laughs> um, signed, Braddy and Caddy. Okay. So, now we got better weapons. So let's go ahead and equip the empty gun. And let's equip the cowboy hat. And let's put that in the box, I guess. I don't know. Alright. Well, where is the box? It's in here. Okay. Let's put that in the box. The torn notebook and the cloudy glasses. Okay. So, now I can just spend all the rest of my money, I guess, since there's not really anywhere else to do it with. So, let's buy Legendary Heroes. And let's buy that I guess I don't know all right so let's um, let's leave and let's keep on going wait okay yeah we're good all right Whew. all right here we go final stretch guys let's do it oh the music is so slowed down all right so now I think we can grind I'm not I'm not sure though I don't know, like, like the thing is, like, I know I keep saying it, but, like, the encounters, like, I just, I'm not sure anymore, because they were the three, in, they were, like, five scripted encounters over there, and I just don't know if I can encounter anything. I'm gonna try to, but I don't know how long it's gonna take, but, um, I'll just cut it in, I'll just cut it back in whenever I get all my encounters. Okay, it seems like we've done it. Nobody came. So, with that, I think we are good to go for the Metaton fight. Huh. Hearing this music again, man. Uh, mm, never gets old. Or it never, like, the, the, un I don't know how to describe it. Like, the uneasiness I feel every time I hear this music, like, it never fades away. Like, it, it always stays. Like, just the I, I cannot describe it it's just un like uneasiness is the best way I can describe it cuz I don't know man anyways uh, I'm gonna save so yeah and with that let's go into the Metaton fight all right my my so you finally arrived after our first meeting I realized something ghastly you're not just a threat to monsters, but humanity as well. Oh my, that's an issue. You see, I can't be a star without an audience. And besides, there are some people I want to protect. Ahaha, <laughs> eager as always, eh? But don't touch that dial. There's something you haven't accounted for. As any true fan would know, I was first created as a human eradication robot. It was only after becoming a star that I was given a more photogenic body. However, 
Those original functions have never been fully removed. Come any closer, and I'll be forced to show you my true form. Fine, then. Ready? It's showtime. Alright, so we have the Metaton fight. Let's go. Oh. Aw. Oh, that's so cool. That's actually really cool. Okay, uh, let's attack. Oh. <laughs> wow. G guess you don't want to join my fan club. Is that's it? Wow. Okay, never mind. I thought there was gonna be more, but okay. I guess. Oh, we got four levels from that. Holy crap! We got four levels from that. That's insane. All right. Well, let's go save. I guess. What? Why is the music still? Hold on a second. Let me go test out if we're good to go or not. Okay, um, it seems like we're good. I hope we are. I, I, I don't know, man. Um, I guess we're good to go. I, I don't know. I mean, if anything, I can just reset. It's not a big deal, you know. But it seems like I've done everything right so far. Alright. And I got a lot of legendary heroes, so I think we might be good. Alright. So now we are going back to the new world. Or new house, I guess. I don't know. Alright. Man. It's, it's been a ride, Undertale. This game's been... <laughs> really, uh... It's something. It's something. Alright, so... You know what? I'm gonna save because... just I just want to be safe, you know? Alright, so we can use this elevator, correct? in use. Okay, never mind. Alright. Is... No, oh, never mind. I thought I heard something in the game. I was like, what? <laughs> Alright. It's taken a while. Just like last time, I guess. Alright. What you got in store for us, End of Genocide? What you got? Alright, so this is the box. Save again. Alright. New home, guys. Haven't been here in a hot minute. <laughs> Alright. Flowey. Howdy, Chara. You finally made it home. Remember when we used to play here? <laughs> Boy. Today's gonna be just as fun. Uh, yeah, it is. No chocolate. <laughs> what? Alright. Alright, Flowey. I remember when I first woke up here, in the garden. I was so scared, I couldn't feel my arms or my legs. My entire body had turned into a flower. Mom! Dad! Somebody help me! I called out. But nobody came. Oh, that gives a whole new meaning to the but nobody came encounters. Wow. Ooh, the gifts. There's a heart-shaped locket inside the box. Uh, let's let's leave it. Let's leave it. All right. Knife inside the box. Oh, oh yes, yes. Take it. I'm carrying too much. Okay, let's just drop something. Oh man. Uh, let's drop uh the mystery key because I don't really know what that does. So let's drop that. All right. Let, yes. Take it. Got the real knife. Yeah. Yeah, I got the real knife. Alright, let's use it. About time. <laughs> oh. Alright, let's see if we look any different in that mirror over there. Eventually, the king found me crying in the garden. I explained what had happened to him. Then he held me, Chara. He held me with tears in his eyes, saying, There, there. Everything is going to be alright. He was so emotional. But, for some reason, I didn't feel anything at all. Nope, still the same. It's me, Chara. Uh, no, it's not Frisk. It's not you. Oh man. All right. <sighs> All right, let's keep going. 
Let's go to the finish. I soon realized I didn't feel anything about anyone. My compassion had disappeared. And believe me, it's not like I wasn't trying. And I wasted weeks with that stupid king, vainly hoping I would feel something. But it became too much for me. I ran away from home. Eventually, I reached the ruins. Inside, I found her, Chara. I thought of all people, she could make me feel whole again. She failed. Ha. <laughs> oh. I realized those two were useless. I became despondent. D despondent. I, I don't know what that means. Okay. I just wanted to love someone. I just wanted to care about someone. Chara, you might not believe this, but I decided it wasn't worth living anymore. Not in a world without love. Not in a world without you. So, I decided to follow in your footsteps. I would erase myself from existence. And you know what? I succeeded. This is... But as I left this mortal coil, or coil, I started to feel apprehensive. If you don't have a soul, what happens when you... Something primal started to burn inside me. No, I thought. I don't want to die. And then I woke up. Like it was all just a bad dream. I was back at the garden. Back at my save point. Interested, I decided to experiment. Again and again, I brought myself to the edge of death. At any point, I could have let this world continue on without me. But as long as I was determined to live, I could go back. Amazing, isn't it, Chara? I was amazed, too. At first, I used my powers for good. I became friends with everyone. I solved all their problems flawlessly, their compassion, their companionship was amusing. For a while, as time repeated, people proved themselves predictable. What would this person say if I gave them this? What would they do if I said this to them? Once you know the answer, that's it. That's all they are. It all started because I was curious. Curious what would happen if I killed them. I don't like this, I told myself. I'm just doing this because I have to know what happens. Ha! What an excuse. You of all people must know how liberating it is to act this way. At least we're better than those sickos that stand around and watch it happen. Those pathetic people that want to see it, but are too weak to do it themselves. I bet someone like that's watching right now, aren't they? Ah. Uh, thanks, Flowey. Appreciate it. <laughs> you called me out, dude. Alright. Nowadays... Even that's grown tiring. You understand, Chara. I've done everything this world has to offer. I've read every book, I've burned every book, I've won every game, I've lost every game. I've appeased everyone, I've killed everyone. Sets of numbers, lines of dialogue, I've seen them all. But you? You're different. I never could predict you, Chara. When I saw you in the ruins, I didn't recognize you. I thought I could frighten you, then steal your soul. I failed. And when I tried to load my save file, it didn't work. Chara, your determination. Somehow, it's even greater than mine. I just have one question for you, Chara. How did you get back to the ruins from here? Wait, I know. She must have taken you when she left, and decided to give you a proper burial, rather than hanging out in the basement forever. But why then? What made you wake up? Did you hear me calling you? It doesn't matter now. I'm so tired of this, Chara. I'm tired of all these people. I'm tired of all these places. I'm tired of being a flower. Chara, there's just one thing left I want to do. Let's finish what we started. Let's free everyone. Then, let's let them see what humanity is really like. That, despite it all, this world is still kill or be killed. Then, well, I had been entertaining a few ways to use that power. Heh. <laughs> but seeing you here changed my mind. Chara, I think if you're around, just living in the surface world doesn't seem so bad.
We don't even need to leave to get them this time. The king has six of them locked away. I've tried hundreds of ways to get him to show me them, but he just won't. Chara, I know he'll do it for you. Uh, uh how? Okay, why am I telling you all of this? Chara, I said it before. Even after all this time, you're still the only one that understands me. You won't give me any worthless pity. Or, you won't give me any worthless pity. I read that wrong, sorry. Creatures like us wouldn't hesitate to kill each other if we got in each other's way. So that's... So that's why... What? Oh, hold on a second, guys. Hold on. Okay, we're good. Okay. Ha. Huh. Ha. Huh. What's this feeling? Why am I shaking? Hey, Chara? No hard feelings back then, right? Hey, what are you doing? But back off. What What are we doing to Flowey? I, I've changed my mind about all this. This isn't a good idea anymore. Y you should go back, Chara. This place is fine the way it is. Stop making that creepy face. This isn't funny. You've got a sick sense of humor. Hmm. I don't like where this is heading, guys. Alright. So, let's see. Alright. Let's save. Um, I'm gonna cut it out real quick because... I think I'm just gonna cut the episode off here because I want to have the final boss, uh, do his thing. Uh, so, or have this whole episode just dedicated to him, because I know that I'm going to spend a couple days on this boss, so I think it's best if I just end the episode off here, and yeah, so with that being said guys, I'll see you guys on the next episode of Undertale, and also, get dunked on!